epidemic that's facing people with automobiles these days, and it is catalytic converter theft. And here to give us some tips, we have Tom Taylor from rockauto.com. Tom, welcome back to Goss's Garage. Thanks for having me, Pat. Absolutely. Now, uh, we're seeing all kinds of uh, vehicles with converter thefts. Yeah, it, it used to just be pickups and vans that are high off the ground, so it's easy to get under there with a, a big saw and chop off that catalytic converter. But a lot of the new hybrids have more precious metals, the rhodium and platinum and palladium. So the thieves have figured out how to scurry under those really low slung vehicles and, and chop off the catalytic converter. Um, they often won't use this, they'll use a, a pipe cutter, which is like a piece of sharpened chain that they just spin around and around and, and hack it off. Yeah, does a nice, neat job too. <laughs> Unfortunately, yes. Yeah, and there, there's companies that make all sorts of shields to put under the uh, hybrids to, to keep the thieves away. Uh, one simple idea I like is put exhaust clamps on the area where they typically cut, where there's access. To just get $30 worth of these and, and stick them on there and make it like a porcupine shape that's hard to get that uh, either a saw or a, a pipe cutter onto. That is a very good idea. I'll have to start recommending that to some of my clients. And, and a lot of these, these hybrid vehicles, they, uh, they don't warm up that fast, the engine doesn't warm up fast, so they'll actually get heat from the catalytic converter to warm the interior of the vehicle. So there's all sorts of plumbing and, and pipes and stuff that can be damaged, increasing the cost of, the, of replacing the catalytic converter. Yeah, that's what we're seeing is that a lot of these is uh, the cost of the whole repair, in many cases, will exceed the value of the vehicle, if it's an older vehicle. Yeah, it's really unfortunate to have a vehicle totaled well before its time for something as dumb as this. So. Mm -hmm. Okay, so clamps around the uh, the pipes and that'll help. Uh... Yeah, yeah j just thinking about where you park your vehicle. If Usually you avoid parking over mud puddles. Now you want to park over the mud puddle. So the, the thief is just, hey, this I'll move on to the next car and, instead of waiting in the mud puddle. So what we're really doing is just making it more difficult so they move on to the next one. Right, right. Like, yeah, like locking the doors of your car, locking the doors of your house. You're, you're just making it harder. Okay. Tom, thank you so much. And if you have a question or a comment, drop me a line right here at MotorWeek.